South Orange, New Jersey, and the campus of Seton Hall University, where tonight, inside historic Walsh Gymnasium, a matchup between the first and third place teams in Big East women's basketball, the fifth ranked Yukon Huskies taking on the Seton Hall Pirates. Position points in this first quarter. Very simple, right? <laughs> Yukon on the road, <laughs> national flag loose, and we're underway, so Nick, There's for 21st. Edwards, the right-hand floater goes. So a three-point Pirate lead. Lopez Seneschal takes the nice feed and scores the bucket and make the shot go. Most of the buckets Wright has to make. Floated into Juhas, gets the bucket and the foul. A transition bucket doesn't have to be just a wide-open layup. Defense wasn't set, UConn attacked. Two possessions in a row. Edwards defended by Bembry. Kicks to Griffin. That shot goes for Aubrey. Griffin slips the defense. And the nice pass in from Lopez Seneschal. Right inside the Cooks, deflected by Juhas. Great active hands by Juhas. Yule pushes up ahead. And Lopez Seneschal puts the brakes on and drains the bucket. Wow. Rebound from Julia Edwards. 35 feet? She's made those before. Absolutely. Juhas, 4-3. Foul call, rebound fight. Edwards will come away with it on the run. Numbers for UConn. And she'll get the bucket and the foul. Head is deep from the minute she got the ball. Look at, she tracks it down. Runs the floor in traffic, finishes. I mean, that's just a heck of a move. She gets it. Kind of one of those players from Seton Hall feels like she has something to prove against UConn. There is Edwards, left alone by Cooks, and drops the two. So here's Park Lane. Edwards gets the steal. She'll outrun Park Lane to the other end and get the bucket. To bury into the ball game for UConn. Lopez Seneschal gets the first breather. Here's the Berry. Nice positioning. Missed the layup. Got a second shot at it. Too casual. Edwards, top of the key. No. Juhas gets it tipped to her, that misses. Aubrey Griffin with an offensive board. And Juhas drains the shot and kicks to right. Now back to part lane, tries to work through the screen. Runs into the lane, blocked by Edwards. Who else? Mule feeds a running Edwards. 94 feet for Edwards for the bucket. It's money. Again, AZ Fudd not here with the team tonight, undergoing further tests back in Connecticut. Lopez Seneschal. It's the first made three of the ball game for Seton Hall in nine attempts. Mule blows by everybody. It's seven. Juhas sets the screen. Mule kicks back to Juhas. Over to Lou for three. And he, and he... Juhas will work to the very screen. Now put up the three and get it. Well, they start with that 28-point deficit in this third quarter. Lopez Seneschal with the first bucket. That's a two. And hard to knock it away. Park Wayne looked up to try and see if she had a shot available and dropped the ball. Juhas ahead of the pack. Will get fouled by Cooks. Q. Edwards gets inside position, misses the layup, gets her own miss, and gets that one. That's a double-double now for Gorka Juhas. She'll post up. Kick to Griffin for three. Up and in. Lopez Seneschal sees the defense coming, avoids, and gets the bucket. No, and rebound right to the hands of Mule, who'll look to push the transition. Numbers to the Pirates, but Griffin outruns them all. Well, she knew she was throwing it to Griffin, who has a motor unlike any other. Griffin into double figures for UConn. Edwards just misses another steal. Juhas on the switch, and Griffin gets the steal. And she'll outrun everybody. Aubrey Griffin's mom, Audrey, was also oh. an athlete and a good one yeah. here at Seton Aubrey, Hall. Yeah. Track and field, all-star. Aubrey to the bucket again. Our own Kara Walters. All right, Kara. Dorka Juhas, a 360 and in. From the top of the key, short. DeBerry with the rebound. Good offensive rebound by DeBerry. Juhas, 
screen from outside. Play in motion. Betancourt off the screen from Edwards. Back to Edwards for two. The kick out, Mule way off on the three. It's the Berry. Gets it! And brings all of her teammates up off the bench. And all of these player losses and injuries and absences and the constant turmoil as the Berry hits a three. That's what they look at when they see the 15 and two. Well, that is the standard that's been set. The Berry fell down. And threw the ball to a cutting bent court from her backside on the hardwood. Lane. Good box out by Park Lane. All right, take you to the rim presented by Duncan. DeBerry <laughs> to Benton Court. Just such a heads up play by DeBerry. Smart move by Benton Court, but to just go to the rim. The rebound. Yukon will push the tempo. Here's Griffin. The turnaround, yes, on it, so doesn't shoot it. Ten to shoot. She'll step back for this one. And get it. Huskies at 91. They've scored 98 three times this season. There'll be two more for Juhas. And a foul. The Berry forces it inside to Edwards. Griffin gets the pass and feeds it back to Edwards. Give that possession. Pinkney gets blocked by DeBerry. Betancourt runs and gets the feed for Mule in the bucket. Standing by with our UConn women's basketball post-game show. You'll get to hear Gina Oriema's post-game news conference on that as well. As Aubrey Griffin drains the three. They've out-rebounded the Hall, 48-38. to 38. And every one of the seven available players has scored with two getting double-doubles. And Nika Mule, by the way, 13 assists on the ball game.